Hi viewers, welcome to all here. We are discussing about a project optimizing ternary multiplier designs with fast ternary header. So this base purpose is completely for ternary logic systems. Okay. So here ternary logic means uh, it's same as a binary. Okay. Example binary means 0, 1. Okay. So here ternary means 0, 1, 2. Okay. That is a three logic uh, level structure. Okay. So here uh, the ternary logic means uh, it's a uh, uh, same as a number system based concept. Okay. So here in our number systems we have a binary, ternary, quaternary, quinary, ternary, separatory. Okay. So a lot of things are available. Okay. So we know uh, the binary and uh, octal, decimal, unsigned decimal, and hexadecimal. Okay. So these are the things we know. Okay. But here this one is a ternary ternary means three input logic structure okay so here we have input means 0 1 2 okay so based upon this input logic uh, we need to construct a number of logic gate first okay so here we need to construct a node gate okay so as per ternary logic and we need to construct an and gate or gate and and gate and or gate xor gate and half address and full address okay so this is a basic concept of ternary logic systems okay the basic logic gate stretches we are taken using this excel sheet okay so here this paper uh, is completely for uh, ternary multiplier okay so ternary multiplier means here they are uh, supporting uh, added with a valestry multiplier okay so here they are used as a valestry multiplier okay so okay so you can verify the architecture in this here okay so uh, in binary concept uh, we will mention a name 8 bit 16 bit 32 bit okay but here they are mentioned a name is uh, 9 trit okay 9 trit means it's a 9 bit same like as okay you can count the number of dots okay it's a 9 bit multiplayer but they are mentioned it's a 9 bit balanced ternary multiplayer okay so here this ternary multiplayer will have a two concept one is a balanced ternary multiplayer another one is an unbalanced ternary multiplayer so this balanced ternary multiplier which uses minus 1 0 and 1 and unbalanced ternary logic which uses 0 1 2 okay so here we are focused only for uh, the unbalanced ternary logic for fpga implementation okay so here uh, in the paper they are developed this work in backend vlsi but we are focused this work in frontend vlsi because uh, in the number systems we will developed in the fpga means okay it will support for a lot of applications okay so that's why we focused uh, this one for front-end uh, development okay so here uh, the ternary, ternary multiplier is a completely uh, work with the approximate ternary uh, multiplications part only not accurate one so here they are mentioned the proposed and approximate ternary multiplier and ternary multipliers which uses a valestry stretches okay so here we are focused 32 truth uh, ternary multiplier so how we are designed this logics in FPGA means we need to convert uh, this logic that means uh, uh, you can verify uh, this not gate okay 0 uh, 1 2 and uh, the output of the not gate is 2 1 0 okay so here uh, we can give a 0 1 in a binary okay but 2 we can't possible to give so we are consider this 2 as a double bit okay so example 0 0 0 1 1 0 okay so if balanced ternary multiplier means we'll focus uh, that minus 1 is uh, 1 1 okay so because the msb part of the one uh, is a negative okay so here so we will consider the two bit of the input for each and every logic gate okay so here not gate means input is 0 0 0 1 1 0 and output is 1 0 0 1 0 0 okay so based upon this two bit logic we will uh, design this work in a fpga implementation okay so that is in ternary concept okay so here this paper they are designed uh, a dot diagram of nine tert balance sheet balanced ternary multipliers okay so one is a standard valestry multiplier another one is a proposed ternary valestry structure okay so here uh, what is existing and what is a proposed means so existing work they are developed uh, with using a two input ternary adder and three input ternary adder okay the proposed work of this paper they are developed a four input ternary compressor okay so here they are introduced a ternary compressor so that compressor will support a four input okay so that compressors will be used in the valestry multipliers they are reduced a number of partial product here okay so here in the figure four 
stroke block diagram so will shows the four trit ternary carry selector adder okay so that is the final addition of the carry chain adder okay so that is the architecture okay and uh, uh, this figure 6 is showing the gate level schematic and uh, for uh, ternary carry selector adder and ternary carry uh, compress adder okay so that is the supporting uh, architecture for figure 4 and the truth table also given in figure 5 okay and ternary logic adders they are given in figure 2 okay so using this components we will design a uh, architecture uh, as per our multiplier okay so here uh, the figure 2 architectures means the sum part sum part is uh, same like as a half adder full adder so otherwise exact gate okay and constant means it's same as a uh, and gate any means it's same like as a or gate okay so this this two tribbles once uh, we have developed in the excel okay then after we will come with this architectures okay so once completed this part okay we'll start with the coding so here uh, we will uh, developed this architectures in 32 trip okay so 32 trip means okay so here you can check this is a 32 trip uh, multiplication part okay so here we have a partial product a0 uh, b02 uh, a31 b31 okay so up to this partial product we are designed the multiplications okay with a number of stages okay so this is the existing uh, 32 thread uh, multiplication this is a proposed 32 thread multiplication okay so using this uh, partial products uh, uh, we will develop the multiplications architectures okay so here each bit th that means uh, each partial product a0 b0 it's considered as a two bit only okay so here we are come up with the uh, test bench okay so in the test bench uh, we need to uh, load the input value okay so here uh, we need to load the input value okay so this is a very low HDL coding okay and uh, yeah this is a uh, input input uh, and output of the uh, trit uh, multi multiplications okay so here uh, input a and input b required okay so here 32 uh, trit means uh, it's a two bit concept right okay so that means it's come up with the 64 bit okay so here we are developed the unbalanced 32 trit uh, trinarium existing uh, multiplayer but it work as a 63 bit okay 63 down to 0 64 bit and output comes with the 127 bit 127 down to 0 uh, sorry 128 bit okay so here uh, before this unbalanced uh, 32 ternary uh, existing multiplications okay so we need to focus uh, for the simulation understanding okay so here uh, first of all uh, we are developed a uh, verla code for ternary to sorry decimal to ternary and ternary to uh, decimal uh, binary systems okay so here we are choose this reference paper so this is a one of the reference for ternary number systems or uh, base 3 okay so this one is for decimal to ternary conversion and this one is for ternary to decimal conversion same as a uh, binary to decimal conversion and decimal to binary conversion okay but here we will choose a 3 power 0 3 power 1 3 power 2 3 power 3 3 power 4 but in binary conversion we will choose a 2 power 0 2 power 1 2 power 2 2 power 3 okay so based upon this conversions okay so initially we will develop the verla hsl coding for ternary to decimal and decimal to ternary conversion in verla hsl okay so once we have developed uh, we will generate an input part so here we are generate an input in random okay so that random input we are given into the decimal to ternary okay for a input and b input okay so that input only we are given into the unbalanced 32 trait uh, existing okay so before this input uh, we will uh, develop this code here you can check the simulation output of this uh, ternary to okay so this one uh, decimal to ternary and ternary to decimal okay so here uh, 2747 uh, is a decimal input eh? and this is a 2747 is a decimal output eh? okay so here you can check the input and output eh? and this is a ternary output okay so here this one is 32 bit eh? okay so here 2747 means okay so it comes with so 100 100 
uh, okay so here uh, we have uh, check this uh, using this link okay so this is a web conversion online uh, link okay so now I'll give this number okay 2747 so decimal to ternary okay so here you can check so 1020 Two two zero two. Okay, so this is a ternary, but we are written this as okay. So you can check this LSB two. Okay, this is a two one zero. Okay, and after that zero zero. Okay, and again two zero, and again two zero. Okay, zero zero. Okay, and one zero one zero again two. Okay, zero zero. Okay, and finally one. Okay, that is a zero one. So based upon uh, this uh, ternary, okay, we are written this logic in binary. Okay, so binary uh, bit based. Okay, so this ternary output we are given into the ternary to decimal conversion. Okay, and uh, uh, we will uh, do the conversion part. Okay, after that uh, it will come up with the final same output okay 2747 so once completed this part of verification okay then after we will use this coding uh, in uh, the multiplication okay so here uh, unbalanced 32 ternary uh, existing top model okay so here as per this logic this existing logic okay we will construct all the partial product okay so first of all uh, we will generate a partial product here okay so this is a partial product uh, generation so this partial product generations uh, come up with a0 b02 a31 b31 and uh, this will construct a simple and gate uh, it's a ternary and gate unbalanced uh, one okay so here we are given two input uh, a and two input b and finally two input a0 b0 we are taken okay so this partial product given into the uh, ternary uh, half address full address okay uh, architecture okay so once this part completed we will check the simulation output here okay so this is a simulation output for decimal input decimal input b and decimal output okay input a ternary input b ternary and in ternary product okay so here we are given this inputs so two two seven four seven five four two okay and uh, this is a second input okay okay we can't compare this two uh, in de decimal okay because uh, decimal number system is totally different and ternary number system is totally different okay so here uh, decimal conversion means uh, we can choose uh, this ternary product in decimal so it will produce some numbers okay but this is not a uh, proper one okay so that's why we will choose this uh, ternary to decimal conversion decimal to uh, ternary conversion so this is a proper decimal value but uh, internal architecture of the uh, ternary uh, logic that means a uh, half address full address and gate uh, and some operations okay so it will produce with uh, uh, 0 1 2 functionality okay so here you can check the full address okay it's a 0 1 2 functionality so as per that the ternary lo logic systems is totally different okay so based upon that it will produce the output here okay so this is the output for uh, this uh, this input second input and this is the output for the first input of uh, 2447 uh, okay so here you can check it okay so this is this is a proper one okay after that after that the proposed method okay so this is a proposed uh, unbalanced uh, ternary 32 thread okay so here uh, it will construct with the uh, input for ternary compressor okay so this is the input for ternary compressor okay so it's a total uh, thing and uh, the thread 64 with the final addition okay this is a code for thread 64 final addition okay so here you can check okay and uh, you can check the simulation for the proposed method uh, it's also produce the same output okay so whatever uh, we are seen in the existing part okay and uh, we are synthesis this code 
uh, in Xilinx Vertex 5 PGA. Okay, so this is an existing uh, model. Okay, 6866 that is a LED and uh, occupied slices 3414 and IO basis 256. Okay, so you can check the synthesis report. Okay, 72.330 nanosecond. Okay, and uh, you can check the proposed architectures. Okay, so this is a proposed one. Okay, and uh, here you can check the uh, RTL schematic. Okay, so this is the RTL schematic. Okay, this architecture is more complexity. That's why it will take uh, not in detailed one. Okay, so if you zoom, you can get a detail. Okay, so it asking reloaded. Okay, so this is a partial product generation block. So once the partial product generated, so each partial product uh, given to two adders okay so this is a ternary full adder okay so here ternary full adder so you can choose two ternary half adders okay so this is a ternary half adder unbalanced architecture okay so this is also same okay so this is a RTL schematic for ternary half adder unbalanced one okay and uh, this is a proposed one okay so here you can check the RTL schematic so this is partial product and ternary half adder okay uh, this is input for ternary compressor okay so this is a technical compressor constant and balance any okay some constant some okay so constant means or gate some means exact gate and uh, any means it's a or gate okay so based upon the logic it will create the architectures okay after uh, this okay we can uh, compare the values in the comparisons document okay so this is a comparisons for uh, 32 trita operating optimizing ternary wireless chain multiplier using full adders uh, half adders logic and uh, ternary force to to compressor logic okay and uh, i have written abstract document for this project okay so this is the best paper abstract improvement of this project proposed title proposed abstract existing and uh, ternary logic systems okay so design advantages okay so related notes uh, okay so literature survey finally references okay so thank you if you need more video related to vlsi project please like and subscribe this channel